Oh yeah, good fish. Come on fish with Latin and you'll have some fun. Catch some fly in Alaska on the wild Yukon. Or catch some trout and salmon in good old Washington. Fishing with Latin, casting with Latin, man that's a lot of fun. Ladies and gentlemen, we're here hiking into Rock Creek in Montana. Uh, it's a nice, gorgeous June day. It's about mid-June. The only problem is the river's super high. So we don't know if we can catch fish. We're going to fish some of the side channels that we find. And uh, hopefully things will work out. We're hiking into a beautiful valley area, or a meadow, I should say. As you can see, very lush and green. Fish on, yeah. Wow, good job, Larry. Good fighter. He's staying down. That's that's whitey behavior. I think it's a white fish too, but oh no. Oh boy, he's a whoa! He's kicking. Wow, Larry, it's rolling. It is fighting well. Oh! oh. Wow! <laughs> That's a decent one, right? Yeah, there. it is. Beautiful. There he goes. Oh, <laughs> look at him go. Oh, yeah, good fish. Came up after the after my uh, yellow sally, and it's a good fish. I think it was on the yellow sally. It looks like a cut. Come on, baby. Woo, good cut. Come on. It's right up here. Came up hard for the yellow sally. Whoa, it's a good fighter. Oh man, it's a pretty good sized fish. I only have 5X tippet on, so I want to be a little careful. Yeah, gorgeous trout. Gorgeous cutthroat trout. Beautiful cut. That was pretty amazing. I've been working a small little riffle. The river's super high, and uh, we came in this little backwater, and I've seen fish rising in that riffle, and I've been trying like crazy to catch those things. And finally, one came up and just hammered it. It's a beautiful cutthroat. I've been seeing fish rising out in this little pool back here. And so I tied on a nice yellow sally dry and below that a yellow sally emerger. And sure enough, came up and nailed the yellow sally dry fly. It's a great fight. This river's ripping, but it is kind of dropping a little bit. We found this really nice side channel right here. And uh, the fish are kind of, seem to be kind of hanging out in here. We haven't caught that big brown trout, but uh, a couple of really nice cut bows so far. We'll keep plugging away. For our home base, we stayed at the historical town of Phillipsburg, Montana. This town had an excellent fly shop with all the flies we needed and also excellent local advice. I continued to work the nice pool, but this time I was working a small back eddy. Fish! Whoa! I made a cast right against that bank. I mean, probably within about a foot and a half. And that fish was right there, and he came up and attacked it. It is a good fish. Man, alive. Caught it right over against this little bank over there, and uh, right up against that grassy bank. 
I don't know if he took the the yellow Sally or the uh, little greenish merger, but if it's still just dogging way down, it's a good fish. Whoa! Come on, baby. <sighs> Big fatty. Oh boy, it's beautiful. I can't tell if it's a cut or a bow yet. But I know it's a big fish. I only have on 5X tippet to my little merger, so I wanted to be a little bit careful with it, but I managed to get it to the net. Oh my gosh! It's a monster rainbow. An absolute monster rainbow. Cut bow, maybe. Actually, this fish has the markings of a cut, so I think it might be a cut bow. So uh, we'll take a look and see, but it's a beautiful big fish for sure. Wow, look at the size. Oh, that was a heck of a fight. You know, I tried to get it in fairly quickly, but I had 5X tippet on, so I couldn't just go too crazy. I uh, fought it for a while and I can't believe the size of that fish out of this little pool. Very exciting. This is a tiny little greenish emerger I used. I am not really sure if it took the dry fly, which is that yellow sally, or this little green emerger, uh, but because the flies just came right out of it as soon as I netted it. But it could have been that guy right there, size 16-ish. Fish on. Larry moved the fish closer and grabbed his net and prepared to land the fish. Is that a whitey? Looks like a good one. All right. Good job. Little cutty. It's always fun on a dry fly. Now that took the that took the nymph. Oh, the merger. Nice little cutthroat here. Oh man, that's great. It's a little dry fly action. There's little riffles here. Aladdin's been seeing and catching them uh, at the ends of these riffles. And every time we see a rise, we kind of go for it. And I cast over the top of a rise right here and drew it back over him. Didn't take the dry, but he took the emerger. So I set the hook and caught that little guy. It's been a good day so far. We've caught some really nice fish out of this area. So we're gonna head back to the rig and look for some new water to fish. Well, Larry and I are moving upstream, trying to find a place to fish. And obviously, Rock Creek is a very popular spot. <laughs> so we're trying to do a recon and find a spot to fish where there's not people. It's not very easy sometimes. Well, Larry and I are heading way upstream on Rock Creek. We've got a beautiful trail here to walk on. Some really nice water. The temperature's gotten really hot, so we ditched your waders. We can do a little wet wading. Hopefully we'll run into some fish upstream here. That's cool. That is very cool. Yeah. My gosh. Larry and I were fishing a nice inside scene. That's a fish. All right. Heck yeah, yeah, good one. Good. Oh. Ladin, that's a good fish. Wow. <laughs> Look at that. You see him on the bank? Nope. But I believe right you. Right there. 
I right there, it looks yeah. like a brownie. That's a big That's old whitey. That's a white fish. Big Dang. old whitey. <laughs> 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 it's a big one though. Boy, that was a fun fight. Yeah. I'll say that. Come on, get in the net. There you go. Whew. Tell you what, this is a good fighting fish. Big old white fish. Show you, give you a look at this thing. What a fight this guy put up. I thought he was a big brown. Let him revive a little. There he goes. Oh man, that is a fun time. I'm telling you what, that thing went down hard. I got a good hook set on him and he fought me all the way down the stream. And uh, boy, it's just fortunate I got that hook set on. It's a good fight, nice fish.